Hey guys, last year we released the Prospector and now we're releasing the Scout, a more compact, smaller version of it. So let's jump into it and check it out. All right, so we'll start on this uh, left-hand side. So this comes in two versions, a passenger side and driver side. This is the passenger side. So at the top here, we've got the fuse holder. Um, this is a 12-way fuse box. Pull that off. Um, and then just below the fuse box, we've got five pre-wired switches. Um, we've already wired one up to the inverter because there's a multi-plus in here. I'll show that later. Uh, just below that, we've got the display for the 7112 BMV Smart Shunt. Um, this one's from Victron, so it'll show you all your amps coming in, out, all your solar, everything like that. Uh, just below that, we've got a 12 volt socket. Um, and then just next to that one, we've got dual USBs. Um, just below that, we've got our solar input. So if you wanted to plug a blanket in, you can just plug straight into there and it's all wired for you. Um, next to that, we've got the power out for an Anderson. So it's just an SB50. Um, so you can plug a fridge or anything like that into it. And just below them, we've got our dual 10 amp GPOs. And then on here, this is the face plate. Um, and just above there, we've got our two RCDs. So we've got the first RCD, which is your power in. So it comes in from shore power, then to your multi, and then back from your multi to your second RCD, and then out to your GPOs. Uh, Anderson plug down here. This is for your start feed, so it's already pre-wired. You just have to plug your start feed in so it will charge it. And we've just got a hole next to it that you can run some other cables into it. Same with a couple holes up here, you can run more cables. And then we've also got our inlet for the MultiPlus. So you can just plug that straight into a 10 amp um, normal house GPO and it will charge your battery through the MultiPlus. So we'll probably pull this cover off and we'll check out what's inside. All right, so having a look inside here, um, just at the top here, we've got our junction stud. Um, this is a negative junction stud. It's just connected to the smart shunt. Um, we've installed that just to make it for easy um, installation of all your accessories, because you'll either be running to the fuse box up the top here or this terminal strip. Um, so we just put the stud up there so you don't have to run all the way down to the smart shunt. You can make it easy for you. Um, so then just below that, we do have the terminal strip. Um, we've already pre-wired the five switches, so they just go to the terminal strip. Um, they're already fused for you, so you just have to connect your output wire to it for your accessory. Um, easy, you just um, strip back the insulation and you can just put it in there, screw down the terminal, makes it super easy. And then there's a couple of spares down there, so if you ever had to solder some wires together, instead of doing that, you can just join them through the terminals. Um, just below that, we've got the Orion XS. Uh, this is a 50 amp charger, DC-DC. Um, you can, by the app on the Victron app, you can um, change it from a 50 amp to a 30 or 40 or whichever you like. So if you don't have an alternator that can handle a 50 amp, you can then lower it down so it doesn't overload it. And then um, just underneath it, we've got the Victron MPPT. This is 130 um, MPPT. So it'll give you plenty of um, solar. You'll be able to chuck it into that and it'll be able to handle it. Um, just below that, we've got our MIDI fuse. This is for the 50 amp output Anderson plug. And then it's all labeled for you so you'd know what it, what it all is. And then just below that, we have our four way mega fuse holder. So this will be fusing all the other gear like the solar, the DC, DC, everything like that, the inverter. It's all labeled again. And then just below that, we've got the smart shunt itself. So yeah, that's all pre wired for you. You don't have to do anything. You just have to connect your negative onto your battery. And just to the side of here, we've actually got the MultiPlus. This is a 1200 VA MultiPlus. So it's an inverter as well as an AC charger. So you get 50 amps of AC charging with this one, as well as a 1200 VA inverter. So it's pretty good. It's nice and compact. And it gives you a, um, a lot of power as well as charging. Um, just below there, you can see the Anderson plug, that's for your start feed. As you can see, it's all pre-wired, so you don't have to worry about it. Um, and then you can probably see some of the mounting 
holes that we've got. So we've got about eight mounting holes in this, um, all in different um, configurations. So whichever is gonna work for you, you should have a hole that um, will work for you. And then we just got a couple holes. This one's only got one. We will be adding more to the future ones just so you can run all your cables in and out of the box to power all your lights and accessories and stuff like that. So that's everything that comes in the Scout. Quite similar to the Prospector, just in a more compact version. Um, you can mount it on the back of canopy walls, camper trailers, even in the back of the car. Um, we will link the website below um, so you can check it out. And I'll see you on the next one.